taking those deep breaths setting back tuning into yourself let the information take you to where you want to be make it conscious of your moves thank you for dancing and breathing with me today and love and kindness family. I'm Karen Khadija Davis, folks, the one and only Conscious Self Healthcare educator and host of the Conscious Self Healthcare Conversation Radio Show. Every Wednesday from 4 p.m. to 5 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, 1 p.m. to 2 p.m. Pacific Standard Time. Community, this is your time to share your wellness stories and how you move from disease care to conscious self health care. I want to hear your story. We want to hear from you. Join the conversation each Wednesday. Call in and share how you shift out of chronic disease care stress. Right here on InnerLightRadio.com, the healing frequency. This is Dr. K, and I am looking forward to our conversation. So call in and share. Help this consciousness and healing is a function of consciousness. Come on, family. It's time to rock the world with the new frontier of conscious self-health care. Why I share my wellness story with you right here on InnerLightRadio.com, the healing frequency. That's right, family. We got to rock the world. Making those conscious self-health care moves. Mental observation is essential for self-success. Taking those deep breaths. Moving that body, taking the time to tune into yourself during this hour. I'm going to make a change for once in my life. It's going to feel real good, going to make a difference, going to make it right. As I turn up the collar on my favorite winter coat, this wind is blowing my mind. I see the kids in the streets with not enough to eat. Who am I to be blind, pretending not to see their need? A summer's disregard, a broken bottle tie. They follow each other on the wind, you know, cause they got nowhere to go. That's why I want you to know. I'm starting with the man in the mirror. I'm asking him to change his ways. And no message could have been any clearer. If you want to make the world a better place, Take a look at yourself and then make that change. Oh, 
done when you come aboard the friendship train you take that deep deep breath of relaxation and know it's time to tune into yourself listen to today's talk go down in one of the rooms and do whatever it is that you like to do that's going on in all the rooms whatever you can think about in the healing arts is waiting for you on the friendship train ride for making conscious self-health care moves. You see, in this day and time, in this age, mental observation view is essential for self-success. Right at that moment, right at that particular time, right what you're doing right now. Taking a moment, taking a deep breath, and thinking about your life. How are you living your life? Hmm, did you answer the questions from last week's show? You didn't write about it. You didn't let me know. The video is up. K. Davis F. You know, right there on YouTube.com. Greetings, family and friends. Thank you for joining me today on the Friendship Train Ride. Where we make conscious self-health care moves. Are you making those moves? Thank you, brother. Thank you, sister. Thank you, elders. Thank you, healers. Thank you, health community, for joining us on the friendship train and sharing your modalities and your thoughts and your education to assist people with becoming their own wellness doctor. Because that's what's needed in this day and time to trust who you are, to trust what you're doing, to understand what you do to the human body. Through understanding the purification system that's supported by that dynamic breath, that breath of life that supports the lymphatic system. Yes, the lymphatic system. Once again, I'm your host, Reverend Dr. Karen Khadija Davis, folks, assisting you from the non-secular science of medicine, where you don't have to be concerned or have any worries, because you are the conscious person that's learning anatomy, physiology, pathology, bioenergetics, understanding how the body works, functional medicine, knowing what to take and what to do and what the cells truly need and the environment that they need to live in. You are in control. That's why you aboard the friendship train ride. Stepping up out of the dark ages of disease care. Oh yes we are. Reaching a new level of wellness today. Yes you are. You can do it no matter what you've been doing, where you've been at, and what's been going on in your life with your health care. If you're not pleased and you're not satisfied, welcome aboard the Friendship Train where you can sit back and make conscious self-health care decisions for yourself. You have that power. Don't let nobody tell you that you don't, that you got to follow anything that anyone says, anywhere, from whatever they do, whoever they are. This is your body. Yeah, isn't it? <laughs> Who's moving around in it? <laughs> Taking that deep, deep breath and tuning into yourself. And you got to enjoy life. And we all are seeing a lot of things and we are truly understanding the power of stress. 
what stress does to the body, what stress does to the systems, what stress does to the environment. Ah, but the great thing about it is you always want to be aware of those things that give you conscious thought. But you don't want to contemplate too long because you understand what to do, what road to take, what choices to choose for yourself. We make conscious self-health care moves. Hmm, this Wellness Wednesday, taking a deep breath. And with every breath, we feel our bodies relax. Our muscles relax. Tension is relief. Hmm, we feel the flow of energy through our body. We feel it all over. We feel it expand. Hmm, as we take those deep breaths and tune into ourselves, we got the power. We got the control. We know what we're doing. Feel that breath move through your body. Feel it down in your toes as you wiggle each toe and that big toe supporting the whole body. Mm, You feel the energy flow through it. You feel it coming up, wrapping around your legs and going up to your knees and passing by your thighs and going around your hips. Ah, Holding you tight around your waist. Feeling good as it comes up, releases itself around the lymphatic ducts. Come up to the neck, round the back, up in the shoulders, back down each arm into the hands. Ah, feel it through each finger. Mm, as it circles its way back up to the front, it comes all the way up that neck, goes all around that neck and reach the face. Oh yes, relaxes. Relieves all the tension in the muscles in the face around the eyes as it goes up into the skull, comes down into the brain and relaxes everything. You're in control. Stop giving your power to people, places, and things. You are in control of your life. It starts with mental understanding of your mental awareness and understanding how the body heals itself, renourishes itself. Replenish yourself, take care of yourself, to stay healthy. You're doing everything right, you say. You're eating right, you're thinking right, you're exercising, you're balanced, you have work, you have play, you have fun. We still need to understand the power of the lymphatic system and how we help it, support it. But the number one thing is the breath. But let's understand from the University of Clarity of the I-L-A. What we're going to do today, family, community, and friends, when we're on this train ride, for all the new people that have been joining us over the past couple of years, you go back in the archives and you listen to some of the old recordings to assist you. But today, because of what's been going on and what we're moving through and how we're now becoming our own wellness doctors and learning more about the body, drugs, and vaccines, and everything, We want to know what was given to us as we came through to planet Earth. The power of the breath that we took, it activated the power of the lymphatic system. And you know, they call that our amazing white blood stream. I'm going to share with you a document from Dr. Sam C. West, founder of the International Academy of Lymphology, where I got my certification from. Yes, certified registered lymphologist. Ah, and then as time went on, Dr. West himself says, I think you're a doctor of lenthology. Don't know about any doctors of lenthology in the Western medical field or any other field, but we have it right here. All those that study through Dr. Samuel C. West became lenthologists. And to those that just know about the lymphatic system and teaching it, I thank you. I think we're doing a terrific job with waking the individual up to understand the power that they have of their purification system in the body. Because most people know that things have to be purified. We have to purify our homes, to purify our air, purify our bodies. Oh, yes. Take care of things. It's nothing like taking care of plants or farming to let you understand the value of life and what you need to do for your body and how your body truly works. So I'm going to share with you about this amazing white bloodstream. You hear about the bloodstream, red bloodstream all the time, stream all the time. So today I'm going to take the moment and I'm going to share with you about the white bloodstream. 
I'm going to read it straight from the information that I received when I went through training. Since I'm repacking again and going through things. And this time it's materials and papers that I have kept for years and years and years. And seeing what I need to keep and what I, what I can release. But then I said to myself, Karen, it's not about what you know. You want to keep this information because you are an educator. You are a conscious self-health care educator. And you're working with people all the time right here on this Friendship Train Ride. Every Wellness Wednesday and when this train started taking off in the real world, we're coming around. We're sharing this information, letting people understand how and why it is time to become your own wellness doctor. So I'm going to share with you some information that I received through my trainer to assist me with understanding the white bloodstream. <clears throat> I'm going to read it directly to you. <clears throat> so I'm going to take this deep breath as I clear my throat. And let me make it through without any interruptions as we move on this glorious day of 2-22-2022. They're talking about the power of the twos today. Manifestation time. Let's manifestate, manifest in our lives the optimal health that we want to maintain. Because we do know we will have cellular malfunctions. Things will occur. But it's how we stay in balance when things do occur. Take a deep breath with me. Sit back, relax, tune into yourself and just listen. And then you can come back and listen again later. Our amazing white blood stream <clears throat> published information that was published January 1965 in Reader's Digest condensed from your other circulatory system published December 1964 in today's health by the American Medical Association copyrighted by them J.D. Radcliffe. <laughs> Now y'all know how I am with these names, so let's see what we do here. Then we were followed with comments by Dr. C. Samuel West. According to a note written on this article, Roy A. Brim of Lincolnwood, Illinois, gave this article to Dr. West in October 1976. The note said he cut it out of the Reader's Digest probably early in early 1965. It was lost until August 10th, 1991. Here are the first seven paragraphs out of this article followed by comments from Dr. Samuel C. West. The complete article is available upon request. The subheading of this article reads as follows, which really summarizes everything for you right here, family, community, and friends. Take that deep breath. As vital as the main bloodstream, the intricate and all but invisible lymphatic network is just now beginning to yield its secrets to research. And you know, you're hearing over the past 10 years, maybe 20 years, more and more people beginning to talk about the lymphatic system, the purification system, how to maintain health and wellness. Well, Dr. Sam C. West started all of this in the beginning of the International Academy of Lymphology. As vital as the main bloodstream, the intricate and all but invisible lymphatic network is just now beginning to yield its secrets to research. And you're here on the Friendship Train Ride. And this is the primary information that I, Reverend Dr. Karen Khadija Davis, folks, share with you on this Friendship Train Ride. As we bring all the sciences together, and medical information, and all that we have, we want you to truly understand the power that you have in helping your body maintain its wellness through the power of the purification system, the lymphatic system. Taking that deep, deep, deep breath with you. Putting you in control to become your own wellness doctor as we support one another <laughs> on the friendship train ride. Take those deep, deep breaths. It is one of the world's rivers of mystery. It is one of the world's rivers of mystery, sluggish, largely unmapped, many miles long, a remote Amazon. 
No, we're talking about the lymphatic system of the body. The lymphatic system has puzzled physiologists since early Greek times. Only now is the white bloodstream beginning to yield up its secrets. Thanks to new tools and laboratory techniques, one thing becomes increasingly clear. Our health, even our lives, depend on how well this complex system functions. The white bloodstream, the lymphatic system. In contrast to the bloodstream, which follows a swift, flowing, closed circuit from arteries to capillaries to veins and then back to arteries, the lymphatic system flows slowly in a single direction. Its initial regulation through microscopic and dimensions originate in inter cellular spaces. Fluid gathered here passes through every enlarging ducts until it reaches the lower neck region where it empties into veins leading to the heart. I know you got to come back and hear that one more time. It's okay. It'll be up on the YouTube channel. Much of the mystery surrounding the lymphatic system traces to the fact that most of its ducts are so fragile that they are invisible. The smallest have walls of only one cell thickness and the fluid they carry is ordinarily almost as clear as water. Moreover, at the touch of a probe, all but the largest lymphatic vessels collapse, as they do at death. Exploring such a stream has caused for supreme ingenious ingenuity, genuine. Among the aids used in an effort to map the lace network of ducts. Two have been particularly helpful first. Opaque dyes which cast shadows on x-ray films. Second, radioactive isotopes which leave a track of telltale radiation. That's how they were able to really see all of the lymphatic vessels, even the smallest ones, like they say with a probe, they collapse. Ah, I know. Go back and listen to this again. Now I'm going to share with you the next two paragraphs. I want you to really listen to very carefully as I share these paragraphs with you. Exploration via these and other techniques reveals fascinating insight into the geography of the body. In many respects, the body is like a vast swamp. Its trillions of fluid bathed cells live an aquatic lifestyle. The lymphatic network, it can now be seen, provides an all important drainage system to nourish cells, blood cap capillaries, consist consistently leak minerals, fat, vitamins, and sugars, along with fluids and blood proteins. Much excess fluid together with cellular waste passes back through capillary walls to be carried away by veins, but not all. If the lymphatic system did not carry a large portion of this remaining seepage back to the bloodstream, we will all bleed to death internally in a matter of hours. Loss of blood, proteins through capillary walls would be particularly disastrous. Now recently, when this article was written, Dr. H. S. Myerson of Tulane Medical School tagged blood proteins with radioactive iodine, then measured the rate at which they pass into lymph vessels. Calculations indicated that half of our 
blood protein is lost from the blood every 24 hours. But were it not for the proper retrieval of the protein by the lymphatic system, this constant loss would spell swift catastrophe. Now think about that. Thus, this great river of mystery may well hold the key to dozens of disease riddles. This great river of mystery, the white bloodstream, the lymphatic system, may well hold the key to dozens of disease riddles as it is given ever increasing research and attention. Discoveries of vital importance to all of us will Evidently be made along its banks. And look where we are, family, in 2020. Believe me, there are more and more people teaching you about the lymphatic system, but they're not telling you that you hold the power. You hold the power in your breath, then you will understand why it was so important for you not to get caught up in this pandemic understanding of masking, breathing in the wrong not oxygen, but carbon dioxide by not letting it out. Understand what we're saying when you understand the power of the lymphatic system and your breath. We're talking about our amazing white bloodstream. That's important purification, keeping the body clean. Oh, so you can work well, move well, do things well. You know how you need to do it. I'm going to share more of this article with you. But right now, I want you to sit back and think about what you just heard. Feel your body. Take those deep breaths. And understand that we are supporting the lymphatic system. And we know that the lymphatic system runs from the head to the toes. Them lymphatic vessels. You can see it. Look at that tree out there with the branches and the, and the leaves and the limbs. And understand the lymphatic system is like a tree in your body. It goes up into the head, all the way down into the feet, the trunk is in the throat. Understand the power of the lymphatic system, the purification system. We on this train ride this well on this Wednesday because we want to understand why it's so important for us to have taken that mask off, to take that mask off, to keep that mask off, to support our children. Not only do we not only are they getting COVID maskology breath, their teeth, they're su- suppressing their lymphatic system by not allowing pure oxygen to come in through the body, through the breath. And breathing out that carbon dioxide and helping the trees nourish themselves. Family, we are nature. We are one with nature. I'm nature. You are nature. Look at nature. Look at the sewer system of nature and understand how it works. We have that same system in our body. And it's the lymphatic system. Yes, it's the lymphatic system. Oh, we know more about the lymphatic system and it's understanding its connection and how it helps the immune system do its job. Understand the systems are one. They work together, not separate. We need every part of the lymphatic system, all our lymph nodes, the protectors. They gather all that stuff and hose it and then releases it slowly so it won't bring no harm in the body. Take your deep breaths, family. Sit back and relax. Listen to the commercials. Understand the power of informational medicine. Dealing with the energetic body. Supporting the physical body by understanding the field therapy of understanding of how our body works and every cell has a field that vibrates information that connects to one another. Take a deep breath. Sit back and relax, family. I'll be back with you momentarily on a friendship train as I'm sharing information with you today as I am a doctor of lymphology, non-secular science and medicine, supporting people becoming their own wellness doctor. And when you come aboard the friendship train ride, that's what we're doing here. We're teaching you to become your own wellness doctor. And yes, we honor you every year. We honor you on April 30th. 
which is Emancipate Yourself from Medical Mental Slavery Day. April is Conscious Self Health Care and Lymphatic Cellular Wellness Month. April is Conscious Self Health Care and Lymphatic Cellular Wellness Month. Understand the power in that. Conscious Self Health Care and Lymphatic Cellular Wellness Month, the purification system of the body. Yes. Yes, 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 yes. I'm taking a deep breath. I'm relaxing and I'm tuning into myself. Thank you for coming aboard this well this Wednesday. I'll be right back with you on the commercial break. Stay tuned. Sit back and relax. You got this. Now that you're aboard the Friendship Train Ride, spread the word. It's time to be your own wellness doctor. And this is how we do it. This is how we do it. This is how we do it. Are you at your wit's end because there seems to be no solution to your health care problem? Is it okay for me to say to you that you can have peace of mind? Take back control of your health. Are you experiencing anxiety, arthritis, diabetes, cancer, fibromyalgia, high blood pressure, lupus, chronic fatigue syndrome, any fictitious disease? Whatever your symptoms or diagnosis are, there is a conscious solution to transform the cause of your pain. Not treat symptoms or mask it. No prescription medication, no over-the-counter drugs, no organs removed are required. Take back control of your health by the renewing of your mind. You can create wellness today. Contact Dr. K. 202-248-7749. Visit us on the web. www the number four the word cell c e l l l i f e dot com. Do you feel lost? Do you feel out of sync? Could it be that you are experiencing electromagnetic sensitivity? Yes, electromagnetic sensitivity. Could man-made frequencies interfere with cellular activity and melatonin production? We are beings of frequency, light, and information, and you are your own experience. Do not conform any longer to the patterns of man-made mindset of human consciousness. Be ye transformed by the renewing of your mind. Schedule your Nest ProVision Human Body Field Scan with Dr. K. 202 248 7749. Visit the website for CellLife.com. The number four C E L L L I F E dot com. Have the courage to expand your horizon and reprogram your cellular activities. Call Dr. K for your 15 minute wellness consultation. 202 248 7749. Is it time for a new approach to your health care? Are you ready to leave the dark ages of disease care management and pharmaceuticals? If your answer is yes, get ready to relearn, rethink, and rewrite your personal health care prescription plan with Dr. K. She is a certified lithologist and Nest health care provider, sharing the new science of information as medicine and cellular ecology. Did you know that the field of epigenetic states that you are more than just your genes and those genes do not control your biology? Yes, that's correct. Schedule a Skype, phone, or office visit with Dr. K and get on board the Friendship Train to Healthcare Freedom. 202-248-7749. That's 202-248-7749. Visit us on the web. For CellLife.com, the number four, the words Cell, C-E-L-L-L-I-F-E, dot com. Hey, we got to help one another. Taking that deep, deep breath as we come back aboard, sharing the information with you about the white blood stream. Our amazing white blood stream, the lymphatic system, the purification system of the body that is supported by the breath. Taking those deep, deep breaths and tuning into yourself and 
understanding the information that I shared with you to allow you to become your own wellness doctor so that you can step up to quantum health and healing so you can use all the technologies to help you be in control of your health care. Taking those deep breaths as we continue the conversation. As vital as the main bloodstream, the intricate and all but invisible lymphatic network is just now beginning to reveal its secrets to research more and more every day. And I've been sharing it for over two and a half decades, maybe three. I'm never keeping up with time correctly because what is time? Sit back and relax, family. Listen to this information. So now this is the following is by Dr. C. Samuel West to what I just shared with you. Oh, but did you hear the commercials? You understand where we are with the New Frontier in healthcare? Schedule yourself for that free, for that free voice scan. Visit my website www.energythenumber4life.com forward slash p forward slash Karen Davis folks f-o-u-l-k-s www.energythenumber4life.com forward slash p forward slash Karen Davis folks F-O-U-L-K-S and step up to quantum health and healing as you emancipate yourself from medical mental slavery because you are your own wellness doctor understanding the power of the lymphatic system Dr. West Dr. C. Samuel West a chemist, lithologist Dr. D.N. and a ND. He wrote this in August 25th of 1991. This new blood protein research revealed the importance of our lymphatic system. So in 1966, two years after this article was published, the government with the help of the army brought all the lithologists from all over the world, even behind the Iron Curtain, to meet with Dr. Myerson in New Orleans. This 1966 meeting was beginning what is now known as the ISL, International Society of Lithology. That's 1966. Now, a few years before Dr. Myerson did his blood protein research, Dr. Myerson lectured for Dr. Arthur C. Guyton at the University of Mississippi, and he encouraged Dr. Guyton to do research on the blood protein in his laboratory. As a result, in 1961, Dr. Guyton made the dry state discovery or the negative subatmospheric pressure condition that the cells are in when there are no excess blood proteins in the spaces around the cells. He discovered that in the dry state, there is only enough fluid to fill the crevices around the cells, and that is all. Dr. Guyton became aware of the dangerous effect that the blood proteins could have when they get out of the bloodstream, causing, because in the first paragraph under his chapter entitled, The Lymphatic System, Guyton said, we shall see that this removal of blood proteins from the intersitinal spaces by the lymphatic system is an absolutely essential function without which we would die within 24 hours. The s- Listen, the lymphatic system, Dr. Guyton said, we shall see that this removal of blood proteins from the intersectional spaces by the lymphatic system is an absolutely essential function without which we would die within 24 hours. And family, community, and friends, you know this is true. You hear about healthy people all the time jogging, running, exercises, doing something and just collapsing. You got to understand the power of the lymphatic system. And what's going on. That's why you want a friendship train ride. To be your own wellness doctor. 
He said, therefore, in 1961, three years before this amazing white bloodstream article was published by Dr. Guyton, published the above statement along with the dry state discovery in the second edition of his textbook, the Medical Textbook of Physiology. Dr. Samuel C. West stated, my role started in 1974 during my fifth year teaching chemistry. He said he had a pain clinic after school and in the response to a question from Dr. Chase, a biology teacher, putting Dr. Guyton's above stated 1961 textbook into Dr. West's hand. He said, I began to use Dr. Guyton's dry state discovery in my pain clinic and many, many things occurred during that time for Dr. Samuel C. West. I'm going to jump some paragraphs and I'm going to go and stay the way he said, I applied for membership in the ISL and, be, and because he experiences had the research on the lymphatic system blood protein discovery, he was accepted in the third, 379th member of this society. Then in 1980, Dr. Samuel C. West was inspired to write an equation that took 31 steps to produce. Step 31 of this equation describes the disease state where there were trapped blood proteins in the spaces around the cells causing the cells to drown. But let me read the article. This equation revealed how trapped blood proteins in the spaces around the cells cause pain, suffering, and every disease known to man and will be known to man. He said when he reversed this equation, it revealed Dr. Guyton's 1961 dry state discovery where there were no trapped proteins in the spaces around the cells. This equation reveals that it is impossible to have pain, suffering, or a disease of any kind when the cells are in the dry state. And that's what we share with you right here on the Friendship Train Ride. Studying with the one and only conscious self-health care educator, uh, Reverend Dr. Karen Khadija Davis. Folks, myself, sharing with you the same way I supported myself when I had this stroke. How I'm moving forward medication free and recovered my, my movement, everything, because of what I know. And putting it to practice, putting it to use, putting it to work. And that's why we have you aboard the Friendship Train Ride to help you understand this information so that you can reverse any any cellular malfunction that you have in your body that's caused by the lymphatic system creating a swamp in your body. We want to help you drain that swamp, drain that pond, remove that excess fluid from around the cells and let your body begin to sing and talk and dance and breathe. Take the mask off. Deep, deep breathe. Deep, deep breath. Emancipating yourself from medical mental slavery. Starting right here on the friendship train. Taking this ride on the friendship train. Setting back, relaxing, doing your own thing. Becoming your own wellness doctor with me. Yeah. You like that family, community, and friends? And, and also I found um, where I had asked some questions um, pertaining to the studies. And in closing with you today... I'm going to share with you the answers to some of these questions about a lithologist and some other things that can assist you with understanding a little bit more about what I do and why when people come to me, I have them uh, join the group Lymphatic Cellular Wellness on Facebook, get the book, learn the book, read the book, let's work together, become your own wellness doctor. Uh, I help support you when you get the book and do what you need to do. Ask questions, come aboard, start taking care of things, showing you reverse, and then share with us every April 30th on Emancipate Yourself from Medical Men to Slavery Day panel radio show right here on InnerLightRadio.com. April 30th, we will air it or it will be live on April 30th, if that's the day for me to do my broadcasting show live. Ah, 
This year is going to be exciting because so many people have learned a lot about creating that swamp starting right there in the mouth, keeping that mask on and learning about the lymphatic system. Ooh, and the organs to the lymphatic system or the immune system, look them up. See what they are. See why that tonsil is so important, why you had to take that mask off and keep that mask off for true healing to take place. Thank you so much for taking the time to listen to the commercials, connecting with me. This is the sponsorship to support what I do as a lymphologist, uh, giving you this information when you decide to use the Nest Health, the Nest Health Wellness System tools, infraceuticals and informational medicine, seeing your body from the quantum field of understanding that there's a field around every cell and the power of that field and how you keep that activated. That's how you support me. You support this radio show that I do live right here, the Conscious Self Healthcare Conversation Radio Show. Friendship Train Ride. Every Wellness Wednesday, 4 p.m. to 5 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, right here on NLARadio.com, the healing frequency. So in closing, I wrote these questions down years ago, and uh, I'm going to share them with you. I see I made some notes and corrections, and I'll go along with it as I close out this show and tell you, be in love with yourself. Love yourself beyond the measures of a man-made mindset of human consciousness and be your own wellness doctor in many of these situations starting right now you can reverse when you learn the pure laws of health I'm going to share them all with you next week so what is a certified lithologist? certified lithologist supports people with the understanding of the art of lymphocyzing oh she put a word in there lymphocyzing which interest or teach people in the care of the human frame, in diet and in the cause of disease, prevention of disease, and possible reverse of disease. We support people in learning their responsibility in keeping their body in the dry state, becoming their own wellness doctor. So where do you receive training to become a certified registered lithology? From the International Academy of Lithology. International Academy of Lithology or ZeroDisease.com. Dr. Sam C. West Sons. One runs the International Academy of Lithology and one went on his own that studied with his father from the beginning. He created ZeroDisease.com and of course you're studying with me right here on the Friendship Train Ride. Woo woo! What is the art of lymphocyzing and what does it reveal? The art of lymphocyzing is a new science that reveals what man must do mentally, nutritionally, physically, spiritually to untrap the blood proteins to keep them circulating in the body via the lymphatic system. This new science teaches man what he must do to prevent and if possible reverse pain, loss of energy and disease. Why are you here sharing this vital information, Dr. K? To keep the blood protein research from the public is to let people suffer and die. To ignore it is to commit suicide. Once you learn this truth to be truth, you must share it. And that's what I do as an ambassador. And, of course, I share what I do to take care of myself. And that's knowing the signs of lymphology. When I had this stroke, I knew what was happening. I knew what I needed to do. Stress will come into your life, things will occur, but doesn't mean that you can't correct and continue to move forward. I want to thank you so very much for joining me on the Friendship Train Ride today, sharing with you about the lymphatic system and the blood protein research. How are cells fed? Every solid structure in the body is bathed in lymph. There are approximately 12 quarts of lymph in the body compared to 3 quarts of blood plasma. The lymph in the capillaries is the irrigation water that brings oxygen, minerals, and nutrients to the cells. What she say? How are the cells fed? Every solid structure in the body is bathed in lymph. There are approximately 12 quarts of lymph in the body compared to 3 quarts of blood plasma. The lymph in the capillaries is the irrigation water that brings oxygen, minerals, and nutrients to the cells. Take a deep breath and relax. What is the purpose of the cells? To generate enough electric 
energy to get power to the organs to work. That's what it's all about. And I can, will continue to share more with you next week on the beginning understanding of the lymphatic system as I share more questions with you. Sit back this week, family. Go to my YouTube channel, K Davis F. Listen to this recording over and over again. All the other ones. Let yourself feel comfortable as a member on the train ride. Think about my products that I offer through the Nest Health Wellness System. Visit that site, www.energy, the number four, the word life, energyforlife.com forward slash P forward slash Karen Davis, folks, F-O-U-L-K-S. And also visit my website, ConsciousSelfCare.com, C-O-N-S-C-I-O-U-S-E-L-F-Care, C-A-R-E.com. Listen to past shows and listen to the past 11 years of Emancipate Yourself from Medical Mental Slavery Day wellness panel radio shows over the last maybe uh, five years and other information out there to help you to become your own wellness doctor. Thank you for joining me on the Friendship Train as well this Wednesday. Everything is moving forward in my life. It's a little bit slow, but they know but we're getting there. That old place of mine where I can sit in the middle of the floor, take a deep, deep breath, and feel like I'm in an ocean of water, looking out the lighthouse, feeling the breath of Mother Nature all around me. And the water waves pounding, moving fluidly through the body, like the lymphatic system, the purification system, the white bloodstream of the body got a hold on you. Setback family, learn about the lymphatic system and don't just stop at what they say. Never ever let them cut out your lymph nodes. Never ever let them cut out your lymph nodes. Take deep, deep lymphatic breath. Get rid of the swamps in your body that's in your organs that's causing them not to hear information from the quantum level. Not able to accept the nutrients and minerals that you feed in the body. Get the swamp out, get the swamp out, get the swamp out. Sit back and take deep, 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 deep breaths. And thank you so very much for joining me today on the Friendship Train Ride. I'll see you next week and I'm still looking forward to coming back this year with live shows. And yes, this train ride this year for Emancipate Yourself from Medical Mental Slavery Day, April 30th. I'm pretty sure it's going to be a fantastic train ride once you share your wellness stories with me. Thank you again and keep breathing through the week. And don't give your power to people, places or things or no one. Don't let nobody tell you any different. You got to breathe out carbon dioxide. And you got to breathe in oxygen. An oxygenated body is a purified body. is supported by the lymphatic system. Which makes you your own wellness doctor. Why? Because you are in love with yourself. I'm in love with myself. Thank you so very much for joining me. Peace. Blessings. Ah, take that deep breath and relax. Stress-free process. Release. Let it go. You're in control. Give your power to no one. Peace. In the summertime I changed my name Thinking that it would change my mind I thought that all my problems They would stay behind I was a stick of dynamite And it just was a matter of time Yeah, I burned
them all I blow through yellow lights and don't look back at all I don't look back at all Yeah, you can call me reckless, I'm a cannonball I'm a cannonball Don't know why I take a tightrope and cry when I fall Are you still taking care of your human body feel cellular malfunctions from an outdated healthcare system? Why not shift out of chronic disease care, stress, pharmaceuticals, vaccines, and surgery and step up to energetics, epigenetics, and quantum health and healing with me? Step up and take control of your health journey. I offer you one free human body feel voice scan from your computer or phone. Instant access to your scan results and more free quantum health information. For more details, visit ConsciousSelfCare.com. C-O-N-S-C-I-O-U-S-E-L-F-Care.com. Or call Karen Khadijah Davis Folks. 202-248-7749. Yes, it's time to be your own wellness doctor. Wow, family, that was a great show. I want to thank you so very much for tuning in to the Conscious Self Health Care Conversation Radio Show right here on Interline Radio. It was a pleasure having you tuning in. Now, you must tell a friend to tune in. And if you haven't called in and shared your wellness story, don't you think it's time that you help somebody with your wellness story? Call in, share your story, join the conversation. I'm Karen Khadija Davis, folks, and I invite you to visit my website, ConsciousSelfCare.com. Or you can just go to the number four, the word C-E-L-L-L-I-F-E dot com. Leave me some information. I would love to talk with you. And once again, I look forward to you joining us next Wednesday right here on the Conscious Self Health Care Radio Show. It's a conversation where we uplift each other, where we share our wellness stories so we can help someone move from disease care to conscious self-health care. Thank you for tuning in. I look forward to hearing from you next Wednesday.